Hello, this is Skyblaze here, and welcome to a new Let's Play on the channel. This Let's Play is Solar 2. If you remember my earlier videos, I have actually done a Let's Play on the of the demo of the game. And, well, it's kind of fun. Basically, all you get up to, well, yeah, I'm not going to spoil any of it, but whatever. So, this is the actual game. How did I get it? It was on sale, and I got it on sale for 75%. Now, let's see how far we can get to it in this first person, shall we? To start, you start out with this small, tiny asteroid. Two mass. Two mass is not a big one. And our objective, right now, run into the tiny little asteroid. I will not go through these little indicators. Those are what you call missions. The missions are there for a completely different purpose, they're storyline. <laughs> Not much of a story, but you can unlock some fun things and we can collect all the stuff we can at the right as we pass through the asteroid stage. As we pass through the asteroid stage, we should be done now. Ooh, desert planet. Interesting. So yeah, asteroid stage, pretty easy, simple. Just gather asteroids, become planet. This one is now a bit tricky. You need asteroids yet again, but this time you just collect the asteroids. So as I said, the missions, we'll get to them at a different time. First of all, let's just play through the game, shall we? And not spoil the fun, the more fun happens later. So, starting off, asteroid, life planet, there are actually eight stages and two branches you can take. Although the branches only branch off at a certain stage, which we'll be getting to later. Basically, my objective is to get, just get through the game. I played the game a little bit, and I played some of the missions, I played some missions. So I know the basic controls, I know exactly what happens, and this is going to turn out to be a fun let's play. I can guarantee you this! As there will be a lot of crazy stuff happening in the future. But first of all, Basically, what a life planet is, is it's, well, a planet with life. It's basically like our own Earth. Ow. That's interesting. Well, you have this evolution meter. The evolution meter depicts how evolved your species are on the planet. And eventually one species will rule them all. Or multiple species. It never says what. And you start with a shield. A good shield. And a couple of ships and a turret. <laughs> Building since it's still planet, we still build the same way. Grab asteroids, do stuff. You start out with you you build up everything, you start with Now I will warn you in this stage if you ever get the game, the turrets do not shoot other planets. Why this is, I don't know. Probably because they got the shield around. Also, music, loud, loud music, loud music, music, very loud. Uh, 
dum dee dum dee dum 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 collecting stuff. Oh, yeah, that's another thing. You can run into your own uh, chips, and in most cases, they will run into you. Uh, if we get a little bit of time here, this should be. Ow. Smacked itself. How does that work? Well, either way. Let's keep going. Ow. That's why you have a shield, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> That's why Life Planet be is extremely good. But... Life Planet isn't the best stage you can be, and I destroyed another ship. Go figure. And there we go. I think, I think something needs to happen. Oh crap, no. No, 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 no. Ship, ship. Uh, fight each other. They blow each other up. But, as you saw, every uh, ship you kill will award some experience. That tiny little ship awarded me with that little sliver of experience. Basically, the experience allows you to do certain things. Sometimes it allows you to build more turrets. Sometimes it allows you to build more ships. Or different types of ships. If you were paying attention, you would have seen more. And that ship's just going to get wrecked. So, let's move away a little bit and just... Yeah, your planet can attack shit. But it can't attack other planets. Ow. My shield. Oh shit! <laughs> no, it's got three kills. Okay. Gotta let my shield be charged. <laughs> Basics of space combat. Little tiny ships are fast. Ah! Second type of ship. That is a bomber that just spawned. And it's spawning a second one. What these guys do is spawn two little missiles every once in a while, and they hit other things. They definitely help you if you don't, if the enemy doesn't have bombers, uh, fighter squadrons. And, it's quite fun watching this. And as you can see, through the experience, I've gotten a third turret in a very awkward position. Ah, the final ship has arrived. Behold, the Dreadnought. Very powerful ship that gets destroyed by bombers. <laughs> Those will be a huge improvement to your ship. To your uh, planet. Those are very powerful ships that can pretty much destroy anything. Also, yeah, I don't know why, but I'm just gathering experience. I just figure, hey, why not? I'm here. I'm close to something. And I know how to control things. I'll slip up. The bombers are. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 You don't want those bombers to shoot missiles at you. <laughs> they wreck shields. Bombers and... Oh, Dreadnought. Dreadnought. Bomber. 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 Please. Please, Bomber. Please. Oh, dang it. Four shields. And we're at full. Also, curse you, Panda. Curse you, a panda has arrived. <laughs> And, uh, you're an ass! Yeah, it's more like you're gonna do it again anyway. Uh, and they just destroyed my own ship. Good job. And now we're at max experience, so let's continue on. I'm not exactly sure on how many ships you get. No, let me check here. It seems we get a maximum of five ships and four turrets. Or 
I don't know. I think they're swerving off for other things. Hello, Dreadnought. You will be the uh, flagship of our force. As long as you are quick enough not to run. Yeah, it seems like five is the limit. So we'll keep that in mind for later. Right now, let's just start gathering stuff. And trust me, this is going to start being fun here in a second. In fact, even though I did it, I, you don't want your planet going through and getting experience for the first stage anyway. You'll know why here in a second. As you can see, my mass will be reaching small star very soon. <laughs> In fact, uh, give me a couple more asteroids, and it should be pretty obvious. Well, well I guess destroying my own sh uh, ships would help. With the change of all. But that dreadnought. That dreadnought. That dreadnought. Traitor! Ah, oh, no. Get back here. Traitor! That's why. Now run. <laughs> run, run, run away. <laughs> uh, what just happened? Well, because I turned into a star, those ships had nowhere to return to. In any case, they turned into white. They turned white instead of green or red. White are nomads. They're the third faction in the game. For life. And they are very, very annoying. But here's the thing. Small stars are actually even... Uh, star? Stages are better by a long shot because, like this developing system here, you can hold more planets. You can ho actually hold planets or foster life for yourself. And another face has appeared. Oh well. Basically, in the star stage, grab planets. So, you might ask, how does one gain mass as a planet? This one should be obvious. Om nom nom. Enjoy enough food. Trick to this? Absorb the planets with the. Absorb like one or two planets with very low mass, or the lowest mass. And if I can find one. They rarely show up, but uh, that would be a okay. Uh... Whoa! Ow! And it was so weird. Oh well. Hey back. So yeah, stars are very. Oh, I know that's. Stars are actually decent. No, you're, you're probably thinking there are seven stages, or eight stages and two packs. Well, we this is the fourth stage. This is the fourth stage, and that was lucky. As we're going here, the fifth stage is already revealed to us. It is the medium star, which we've seen the next few stages already. Give me your soul. And as thus we have now reached medium star. Now each certain size of the stars will give you a different level of planets. Or a different amount of planet beings. Small star gave us three, medium star gave us six. The large star that's coming up will give us eight. Yes, eight. And no man, no man. Get away! 
Get away, you power pickers! Fine. Oh, oh, come on! That was cool. Me. He was a friend, and I killed him. And I think his plan just blew up because he just went too far away. That or you went too far away. Ow! That's what happens when two plans collide, ladies and gentlemen. So, yeah. Those circles were mission spots. I am avoiding them at all costs. And of course, while I'm off screen, yeah, I wander course toward a large star. Come here, come here, come on. So what's the point of this game? Well. There's several points. This is just a screw around sandbox game, really. <laughs> no honesty. I like it because it's a screw around sandbox game. Come on, where's one of them? Are you. Come on, are you serious? Uh, well, I got more mass because of it. I'm not gonna complain. I thought I collected that. Apparently not. <laughs> Give me your, uh, celestial body. I'm trying to make a star a, uh, space. Okay, you assholes. Ah, this is why I don't... The sun. I am the sun. Praise the sun and become part of me. Damn it. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, go fight them. Oh, shit. That planet's dead, isn't it? Yes, it is. Dang it. I've never had this much trouble finding like planets. Yeah, you can find like planets out here. You've seen a few of them already in this episode. <laughs> and no matter now, we're having that planet. I'll take it. Fine. Damn it. Yes, 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 yes. I got one. I got a life planet, even though it was just evolving. Yay. That's good. Now I need another one. Yes, another one. Another one. No. So, there's an interesting thing about life planets that make them a very indispensable materials in this game. And why you want to collect a couple of oh, da, 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 run away, run away, run away. <laughs> ah! Up! Gimme! Give Gimme! Give Give I have a max. I think. Okay. So what happens when you gain a certain amount of life planets? Oh, right. Right. Head death. 
I completely forgot about that. You'll understand here in a second. Just let me go over here and grind some XP. Fight. Fight. No, don't come near me. Don't come near me. Of course, that thing has it. Don't come near me. Don't come near me. Yes, I got it! So what just happened? Besides becoming a large... Uh... Star. I got a shield! I got the shield! <laughs> Alright. Kill it! Just kill it. Kill it. Thank you. Uh, so, yeah. Two life plants. That have enough experience will give you star a shield, and this shield is indispensable because your star has a shield. You can now do some crazy things, like uh, uh, star system ravaging and killing of your own fleet. Uh, congratulations! This is automatically turned to, to complete and utter idiocy. And yes, a large star has eight. And did I mention there were eight uh, phases and two branches? Well, I have not gone the second path yet, but the second path is the uh, worst path if you want to just complete the game quickly. So we're going to avoid it for now, and I'll show you at a later time. Ooh, 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 come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Thank you. Feed me. Feed me. Feed me. Feed me. Feed me. why they never added a gas giant stage in this game. Would've been nice. I mean, you can still have life on a gas giant if you're uh, resourceful enough. And it's more mass. Be great. Sorry, my nose is stuffed up. <laughs> of service to the great one. And yes, asteroids, wreck, shield. That's why I'm trying to desperately try to catch him instead of uh, hit him. I just killed that planet. Jeez, I am. 
Nai is good at game. No. Welcome to Solar 2, a game that screws you over every single time. Yeah, you'll turn your own chips into them. Two! Get. Three! No, 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 no. Come here. Thank you. Yeah. That's the thing. You have Neutron Star Stage. The stage that was not initially in the game when it started. This thing is more massive than the Arch Star, yet it only holds four planets. And upon reaching this stage, you can see our final destination. Our final stage is coming into view. And I'm sorry, but I have to kill you now. Because I actually need space. So, on our journey to become a black hole, we have reached all the way to a neutron star from starting off as an insignificant little asteroid. Hello, Nomad. And thus, we'll be ending off our first episode of Solar 2. See you guys next time.